Hi, I'm Carrie. I'm the C part of KNC Taxidermy. We're new to the field. We've only been doing it since 2021. We went to school down in Georgia, the Custom School of Taxidermy, and it was all my daughter's idea, not mine. Uh, I was teaching. I've been an art teacher and done some administration work and really bored uh, with all that. So when she brought up the subject of going to taxidermy school, of course, being going to school for art myself, I was all in. So we went to school uh, together, which worked out really nice because when she signed up for school, they said that she could bring somebody with and there was no additional charge. So we went together and we now formed the mother and daughter team of KNC Taxidermy. We've been doing it for about two years. There's a lot of things that we're still learning. We're still in the process of getting down right. It's, I don't think, I don't think you do taxidermy with, without ever stop. It's always a learning process. So we're trying, there's still a lot of kinks we've got to work out and, and trying to watch online to find educational or tutorials is, I found it very difficult. So we're trying to get it out there to help others. Uh, you probably won't see much of Kaylee because she's has a job. She's young and has a life. I don't. <laughs> so I'm here at home with the shop doing, doing my thing here most of the time. This is what I do. Primarily takes up most of my time, especially during deer season, as you can imagine. We stay pretty busy. We do our own tanning and fleshing and mounting here in shop. Um, I know a lot of taxidermists send their, their hides out for tanning, but we do not. We do it all here. Uh, we did learn that in school, and I know that's a, that's a big thing, a lot of taxidermists. So we do do wet tanning, so I know a lot of people don't agree with that, but we do our own thing, and I know you do your own thing, so, but... If you'd like to follow us and learn how we do things and or just to see, even if you're not interested in it, just to watch and see how it's done, how we do it, uh, we'd encourage you to follow us along and watch watch the uh, taxidermy extravaganza <laughs> at KNC Taxidermy. But uh, we... Like I said, started in 2021. It's still we're still learning the game, the practice, the trade, and I got into it uh, through my daughter going to school with her, and I have family members that do it as well. And it's always been an interest and a love of mine, so of course I jumped right in. Uh, we're hunters and fishers ourselves, fisher women, I guess, ourselves. So. Uh, of course, it, it fits right into our lifestyle. Um, but we're, we'll, should, we'll be showing everything from form prep, setting the eyes, uh, creating your own septum for the noses. Uh, we do our own ears. We don't use ear liners. We do uh, Bondo ears. Um, so we'll go over all that. And we use, we use Bondo a lot. For I know some people just use clay for setting antlers, and but we use Bondo for ears and antlers or horns, and well, so we're gonna go through the whole process from taking out of tan, which we use Crotan, um, taking out of tan, neutralizing the capes, um, and form prep, and everything like that. So I hope you follow along and follow us and watch what we do here at KNC Taxidermy. And we have a lot of live animals too, which I'm sure will want it or not, try to help. And so it's always interesting. We have a lot going on here, and which, which always makes things fun and interesting at KNC Taxidermy. So hope to see you soon. Bye.